this area, I was going to say we're not going to talk about it, but we are because it'll bother me if I don't explain. So do y'all see how crappy this looks? I know, I know, but there's some areas up here. I don't know if y'all can see them. Anyways, what had happened was I'm redoing the bathroom and the paint in here has runs in it. And when I say runs, I mean like for whoever did like the first or second paint job, there was just some runs in the wall where it would like stream down, you know, but what's happened is that then there was a second, a third, a fourth, I don't know how many layers of paints in here, honestly, but it just kept layering up. And so those runs kept looking thicker and thicker because they just keep getting more paint piled on top of them. And they told me I could probably sand it off or I could scrape it off if I wanted to and not have to do the entire bathroom, just do the areas that irritate me the most. So that's what I've been doing. I got a scraper for Lowe's to scrape paint off the wall. I don't know why I decided to do it right before the holiday season. So I've kind of been at a standstill because of the holidays and Thanksgiving dinners and everything else. So she just looks like that for now. I just finished getting ready. I just threw, I was going to say I threw some curls in my hair. I threw some mousse in my hair. My mom is a cosmetologist and she always does my hair, but she permed my hair six or seven months ago, which it definitely needs to be redone. I was talking about that the other day and I was like, yeah, but I don't know if I want to perm it again. Or if I don't, I'm going to just work on the food trailer today. We have an event this weekend. It's in yesterday's vlog. We went grocery shopping yesterday to get some stuff. I went with my parents to a new, like uh, the restaurant depot we'd never been before. So if you want to watch that, check the last vlog out if you haven't already. The trailer is clean. I just want to go through and organize it. The audio over this first clip sounded horrible, but I still wanted to explain what you all are looking at. You're thinking, why in the world is everything on the floor? Before we leave to take it to an event or take it home from an event we put the oven as you can see there and the chalkboard and such into or onto the floor because when we travel if we don't do that it will fall into the floor and break so that's why i have a lot of stuff in totes you'll see too and that's because that way my totes can set on the floor of the food trailer when we're traveling but spoons forks etc aren't spilling all over the floor can we just take a second for this beautiful outfit of the day? I mean, not really, but I have this shirt. I wore it so much and um, the collar is just like very loose and I don't like the way it sits now. This used to be one of my favorite shirts, but uh, this is my cleaning clothes. I don't care if they get dirty. I don't care if they get stained. I keep outfits specifically for cleaning and painting and stuff like that. So I don't have to waste clothes. So this is my little outfit of the day. And then I just have on my hay dudes. When I first come out here, I get very overwhelmed because it's like I put stuff up, if you can see, that I'm going to have to put right back down. But some of this has places to go and I want to sweep them off the floor so that way I don't have to do it tomorrow. Um, but it is overwhelming a little bit at first, but once I get into the groove of it, I'll get it. I'll get it knocked out. Hey there, buddy. It's just me again. Came into my mind last night, so I'm just, I'm just checking in. It's been far too long now since I last saw you, my friend. So happy Christmas from me to you. Hey there, buddy, it's just me again. Still working on the fridge, as you can see. Some stuff leaked, and I had to go through some things and organize them by use date. But I got it all figured out. It's still not organized, though, because I'm taking these out now and taking them inside to clean them. I need to take this inside. It's uh, one of the things out of the fridge that I need to bleach anyways, and then like the uh, hot chocolate bomb and stuff and extra stuff that is just taking up room in the fridge is going inside. Putting up some bell peppers and I found a baby bell pepper. I never knew this until I, Junior told me that when you find a bell, baby bell pepper, which is what they call these, I guess, um, in your pepper, it means you're going to be pregnant or find out you're pregnant soon. So, you know, we'd love that here. We've been trying for over a year now, uh, but... I just wanted to show y'all because I thought that was cute. 
I made myself cinnamon rolls for lunch because I didn't feel like eating anything at breakfast time. But I have really been craving cinnamon rolls. So I finally made myself some and now I'm going to eat and then get back to cleaning the food trailer. Currently, I always try to look at the time on the oven and I'm literally wearing a watch. It's 5.28 p.m. Junior come home for a little bit, but he ran in, I made him a few sandwiches, and then he left out on a tow. So, he should be back shortly though, I think any time now. So I'm going to put my phone on charge and then probably try to do some editing on my laptop while I'm waiting. Because I'm trying to stay ahead of the game so that this weekend I don't have to worry about Vlogmas. It's already up and I just have to post it publicly. So, we'll see. Oh, I I needed a flashlight earlier. I can't get our rechargeable one to charge, and the one with the magnet that's on the fridge. I replaced the batteries and everything, and I can't get it to work. I want a flashlight for Christmas. The lighting is horrible, but I wish y'all could wish y'all could just sit next to me for a moment though next to this christmas tree am i the only one after they get the tree up that you just want to sit by it i love sitting by the tree so i sat here and i've been editing i got three videos edited and ready to be uploaded thank god reading again i was reading my book here it's choose me it's by heidi mclaughlin is that how you say that i'm trying to talk quietly because junior is in is in bed asleep we just had spaghetti for dinner i've been editing videos since dinner uh, and reading my book. I don't like to read. I mean, I do, but if I borrow a book from somebody, I'll finish it in like three days because I'm worried about getting it back to you. And I noticed that I checked a book out from the public library for the first time in years. The beginning of this year, I checked one out and I read it in like a week because I was so worried about getting it turned back out in on time that I read right through it. But if I own the book and I know that it can sit on my bookshelf for as long as I wanna keep it, I don't ever finish it so I checked this book out from my public library and I'm almost halfway through it I'm out from the public library if you're like me and get anxious about returning things on time because then you'll finish it before it's return date I'm gonna head to bed now I hope that you all enjoyed this video make sure to subscribe I will be posting every day for the month of December for vlogmas and I'll see you all tomorrow